Okay, let's give you guys some more practice. So find the limit of this as x tends to positive infinity. Um, I'm about to give you a clue. So if you don't want, if you don't want the clue, then press pause and have a go right now. Okay, as a clue, times top and bottom by the conjugate. Okay, so uh, so press pause and uh, and have another go. Okay, so to do this, um, when you times top and bottom by the conjugate, the good thing about multiplying uh, by the conjugate is that it simplifies itself. So when you get this times this, it will give you x squared. The middle two terms will cancel each other out, and then you've just got this times this. So this will become a negative, and then whatever's in the bubble here, so it becomes that. And then uh, when when you tidy this up, um, it will it will give you it will give you this. It will give you this. Now you can use L'Hopital's rule, but um, it, it 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 will be a lot of work. The uh, the trick is to realize that as x tends to infinity, this thing here is actually uh, it's actually x as x tends to infinity because because if you look at this here here you've got here you've got this thing here as x tends to infinity this will be insignificant in comparison to x squared so as x tends to infinity this thing here you can consider it as as x squared you can consider it as uh, as x squared because because here you've got x squared plus x as x tends to infinity uh, this would be insignificant in comparison to this. So just consider this this whole thing here as x squared. So you've got a square root of x squared, which is x. Um, so so as x tends to infinity, realize that this thing here is is really x. So so here you've got negative x, and then here you've got x plus plus, uh, and then uh, and then this thing here really is x the as x tends to infinity. Um, if you get a graph plotter and plot this, so that's this red line here, and then uh, and then uh, get a graph plotter and plot y equals x, that will then give you this blue line here. If you zoom out, uh, if you zoom out, uh, y equals x really be, um, this thing here becomes y equals x. So what I'm trying to say is that as x tends to infinity. Um, if you look at this here, this thing here will be in, insignificant in comparison to x squared. So as x tends to infinity, you can imagine this whole thing here as being x squared, and then you've got your square root. And then uh, as x tends to infinity, this whole thing here will tend towards x. So this really becomes this really becomes this. It becomes uh, that that thing earlier becomes x. So now you've got x plus x. That's two x here, and then this thing here. Divide top and bottom by x. Well, as x tends to infinity, this thing here becomes negative a half. Okay.